All right, we're taking a quick preview look at AI Builder 2 uh, from Tin Man Systems. Uh, this is a Windows-based application running on Windows Vista or later. Uh, we're looking at the main interface now. Um, point out a couple of key areas. You've got a ribbon bar across the top uh, with uh, all of the commands relative to what you're working on at the time. Uh, you've got a utility components palette with five uh, separate categories of components to uh, build your system. Uh, you've got your main interface or work area here, and this is where you um, add modules and connect those modules and uh, eventually go inside those modules and build out component structures using the uh, components available to you in the palettes. Uh, to the right here is your system modules tree structure that essentially will track with you and provide a uh, drill down tree um, uh, for uh, navigating your structure. Uh, you also have a system view, a mini view um, a map that will follow you and uh, essentially give you a way to navigate and move to different components within your structure uh, as you build out that system. Uh, and When I go back to the system view mode I'm looking at just the modules um, that you uh, have within the, uh, the larger structure and if I double click on those modules I enter into the component level structure of that. You can see in module 2 we don't have any components yet uh, but we certainly could add some and begin connecting and, and uh, connect with the other modules through these connections and eventually you'd uh, connect to the outside world and that's your inputs and your external outputs. Um, but taking another look here, um, the interface allows for uh, a real uh, a familiar drag drop connect and configure approach and uh, once things are connected, even before they're connected, you can always simulate and uh, given the simulation speed, uh, essentially the system is uh, executing cycles uh, in its relative order, uh, execution order, 15 times a second here and um, uh, but you can change uh, change that speed. You also down, have down here a um, uh, kind of system feedback, execution feedback and some various uh, results that uh, the, the system itself might want to communicate back to you. Um, but that's the interface and we'll drill down on some of these uh, on how to build a system, what these components, uh, how to, to use the components and um, how to navigate throughout uh, the environment itself.